I'm out of breath. I just went to go start my car. I have freaking really four minutes, but I'm going to stretch it. Oh, I can't be stretching. I'm going to be late. And I cannot rush because it's not outside. I went to go start my car because it's snow all on it. What was I saying before I said something about a car? We're not supposed to wear hair scarves or hats on scrub day, but if I can't doctor this up, because I have, if I can't doctor this up, I will be done on the hat. But anyways, y'all, good morning. I look pale. What's going on? Bring my melanin back. Thank you. Y'all, there's literally no fixing these sideburns. So, what I'm gonna do, it's okay, I'm getting my hair done. Sunday. Where did it go? Mm, it's time for me to go. I look like Elvis Presley with these sideburns. I'm not sure. Good morning, y'all. I feel like this vlog is a little choppy because I woke up a little late because I thought we had a two-hour delay because we didn't go. Like, it's six o'clock in the morning. Like, they be out here revving the engines like like everybody finna get out their car, fall to the knees to their car. It's six in the morning. Say that for after school, Buki. Anyways, I thought we had a two-hour delay today because we had a snow day yesterday because look at all this snow out here. It's crazy. And come to find out, we we, we didn't have a two-hour delay, actually. Look at this, y'all. It was so cold. And when I walked into the school, my glasses, like, flew to the side of my face like this. And I'm just walking in the school like this because I can't see. Then, because my glasses not on my eyes, snow got in my eye. So now I'm walking like this, looking stupid. But anyway, this is what I got for breakfast, y'all. I don't know how long. These canola bars are, like, literally from summertime. But I'm starving. My stomach is touching my back. And so I have to grab some. Then I got my handy dandy. This is stale. And I'm still going to eat it. But anyway, this is not the same water bottle as you that I showed y'all in my last video. I mean, in my hygiene video. I broke it. So I went a couple days ago to get this one. It's bigger. And it matches my aesthetic, so. <laughs> A new patient? A new patient. Because they gotta do a girl. I remember letting that all looks like a girl. I think this looks like a boy. That pelvic part letting all those. Okay, it has an air bubble at the top. At the top where yep, push it in. See that? Yeah. And then make sure when your needle pull it back into your liquid. Alright, and now pull back. I wanna set it to something. I'm gonna want pelvic when I set it. Look at you, there's no bubble. So now go ahead and push back up to 30. Point three. You see that? Uh -huh. Now pull it out. I'll pull it upside down. Flip, flip it. Okay. And pull it out. All right, so now there's a beveled side of the needle. That opening. You okay. see that opening? Yeah. So when you're doing a sub Q, intradermal, you want to make sure that the bevel side's up. Okay. Because when you're doing an IM, you're going in 90 degrees, you still want the bevel side to be up as well. Okay. Okay? So let's do a sub Q. You remember the angle? Okay. Yeah, it's good. Slant it? 45 degrees. Okay. Okay, because that's 90 IM, sub Q, intradermal. Okay, so I have to squeeze it? 
yes, you want to pull on the fatty tissue. Okay. Okay, and inject. So this make is sure. Only for intramuscular, it's right? Only for intramuscular. Okay. So make sure this little dip in the needle is up, right? Yep, and do not put this on the plunger. Okay. You don't do that until it's inside. Yep. So I like to hold it like this. Okay. Okay. So you have more control. <clears throat> You're listening to me as I'm telling her, right? Mm -hmm. I see. Okay. All right. So when you inject that, your needle goes in all the way, but make sure that you don't this, come out and hit your yourself. finger. Is this the is right angle? Like, yeah, that's it. And then I will put the needle all the way in before I inject it or yep. just the tip of the needle? No, all the way in before. Don't separate something. Is it a type of way you have to do it? Uh-uh. You got it. Oh, you Miss Lassie, you made me shake. Oh, I'm so oh you're sorry. good. Still hold on to the fat? Yeah, you would, uh, and yes, and then inject. Oh, guys, I just and gave then a pull shot. It out. <laughs> Look at you go. Oh, oh rub it oh. and put a band aid. The CNA start. So you would be one I would send. Y'all, let me take this out. Y'all, I just got out of school. Not really. I get out of school at like 9:05, and it's 9:19. And oh, I'm disclaimer. My lips are ashy. My face is red because it's cold outside. But anyways, and I look a mess. I got out of school at 9 5 but it's 9 19 i just got to my car i stayed after to help my teacher straighten up our lab because we low-key leave it a mess and she'd be in there by herself straightened up so i stayed out there to help her why did i drop my phone in the snow and i had no clue but i was looking for it so i could record this clip but i was like what the frick is my phone the good thing i have on my watch today because i said ping my iphone right and then it starts pinging and it, i hear it but it's faint, like I hear it. Then I open my door. Why did I almost run over my phone? Like this close. Let me tell y'all how good God is. Cause your girl don't have no money right now to pay or replace a new phone. But anyways, I wanted to go to Starbucks after school, y'all. And why don't I have my wallet? And I just knew it. I just knew I wanted to go to Starbucks and I went, this was my plan. I wanted to go to Starbucks and I wanted to read my book. That's the only place I could literally sit down and read a book. So I forgot well, I forgot the book at home. So I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna go to Starbucks, come home and try to read my book like downstairs on the couch or something. Only from my wallet. And you guys might say, use Apple Pay. I'm old. I don't have Apple Pay. Okay. turkey bacon in the oven because i'm gonna make me some breakfast but y'all i think i'm becoming ocd and i don't want i don't want to call it ocd because i've been watching stuff about ocd lately and it's mental stuff and I, it's like more things that come with being ocd than always wanting to clean up or something but y'all i promise y'all for the last couple of days i have came home to clean up even if it wasn't dirty like clutter mess it literally irritates me
like a mess. But I just finished eating breakfast, y'all. And I t I was trying to sit downstairs so I wouldn't fall asleep. So <laughs> I was trying to sit downstairs, be productive, so I wouldn't fall asleep. But I'm exhausted. I went to sleep late. I woke up late, but that didn't help much. So I'm going to go take a little nap. If we're, I'm, I usually sleep my whole day away, not going to lie, y'all. But I'm going to try to take a little two-hour nap. I'm going to get back to y'all if I do something else today. Okay, y'all. I just kind of woke up, and I'm going to go get altered for my prom dress. Um, And I'm also going to go pick up my brothers from school. One of them get out at 220. The other one get out at, like, 340. So I've got enough time. And it's, like, 150. I'm going to leave to go pick the first one up. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to go get altered for this prom dress, y'all. I'm so excited for prom. I think I'm going to look so good hope so i really hope so and i just seen this well and drew just sent me this ultra ad on tiktok and i got this new mascara but where i live there's no ultra around me it's pretty far out but i do need a new mascara because i haven't been wearing lashes lately and i'm cool with the bare face look and i don't plan on putting lashes back on until prom like getting my lashes done until prom so i think i just might go cop that i don't know i might change my mind nine times out of ten i will but I put on something like tight because I don't know how dress alterations work. I was going to put my scrubs back on, but I was like, those are kind of bulky because I wear them because it's cold outside. But I was like, no, let me put on something tight so they can get my ex exact. A spicy chicken sandwich and a small high C with extra ice with Chick-fil-A and honey mustard. No fries. No fries. Right, Thank you. This is literally what a Thursday looks like for me, y'all. So me and Eli are at Dollar Tree, and it's a new dog. It's like a, it's like a, what is it called? A super Dollar Tree. Like it's huge, and they got. I have never seen no Dollar Tree with no full blown dogs. Like I've never seen nothing like this. The Dollar Trees around here, they don't like what the heck? They got clothes. They got clothes for the dolls and everything in here. I've never seen a, that. I've never seen Barbie. I've never Can seen nothing something? like that. Y'all, look at the freaking Tupperware. We're in Dollar Tree, y'all. As you guys can see, I'm back home and I've already changed clothes. Or I'm, I've already gotten a shower. And I'm about to show y'all what I got from Dollar Tree. So I got some Boom Chicka Pop. This is the best popcorn, y'all. I don't care what nobody say. This is the best. It's better than Smart Pop and all the other pop. Boom Chicka Pop, the best popcorn. I got some cranberry juice, the best flavor in cranberry juice. Like, I mean, the cran strawberry, cran grape, it's all good and all, but it never tops the original cranberry juice. I also got some hangers because I keep getting new hoodies and I be stealing other people's hangers. So I needed this. And it's seven in here for a dollar. And I feel like it was a good deal. And last but not least, I got a puzzle because I be bored. Guys, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy. I wish I could record more, but the devil is working tonight. So I'm just going to, you know, edit what I can and put it out. But with that being said, don't forget to thank God for waking y'all up. Don't forget to thank God, period, y'all. Like, if you woke up this morning and if you left and made it back to your home, to your home safe, you need to take time out of your night tonight or whenever you're watching this out of your day today and say thank you god that is very important so thank y'all so much for watching this video do not forget to like and subscribe tell a friend and tell a friend i love you guys i'll see you in the next one bye